Uh, it's one of those nights if you hear it, you just roll over and go back to sleep. Now have to get up and check things out. Heaviest now, as you can see here in southern Macomb County, down through Detroit, even down to Down River. And now that is all moving straight north. And so it'll be heavier on the east side, obviously, the west side. We talked about that earlier uh, this evening and a little bit yesterday. Otherwise, if you don't have showers right now, like a lot of us do, uh, even the spots that look completely dry, there's a lot of that fine mist. It's a steady, heavy, fine mist with the moisture going. A lot of that's happening up here uh, between M59 and I-69, uh, not so much down to the south of Monroe. This is the center of the system, basically sitting about 15 miles west of Monroe. It's moving north, northeast through the area here. And as it moves away, the next one moves in. So there it goes later on tonight. And here comes the action from the west. Now in between there, there's a pretty good gap and that is tomorrow. Most of it is probably going to be dry. I wouldn't count on getting real excited. It's not a pretty day. There might be a few peaks of sun, but not much. But look at the difference in the rain. We're 50 out there. They're still 61. They were well into the 70s today. We'll get to the 60s tomorrow. Not the 70s because we don't get the sun they had, but that's the dry pocket in between the two systems. Then it helps us out. And then it does get chilly as we get through the second part of the weekend into early next week, which is early May, May 1st on Monday. So in the morning tomorrow, there might be a little shower here before 8 o'clock. And then in the evening hours, there might be some showers coming in from the west after 7. So again, much of that is dry. That's the day to do something if you got to do something outside over the weekend. Now you got to deal with the mud and the, and the moisture that's in the ground because of the steadier rain. But that goes through and then Sunday we have a couple of rounds, one in the morning, one in the afternoon here. And uh, I don't think that's going to be particularly heavy, but that is the start of the cooler air. Monday at noon and the things on top of us, the next system and back behind that we cool off. So Monday's cooler, Tuesday's cooler, and then we start to fight back beyond that for next week. So overnight, 45 in Port Sanilac, 50 in Detroit. That's kind of the range around here. Less rain late as the system starts to pull north, but it takes most of the night to do that, especially, of course, on the north side. And then 63 tomorrow. It's about where we should be this time of year. The average high is 64. The average high is 65 by Monday. That's May 1st, but we start going the other way instead, and it's only 48 there. Coming up in the uh, Super 7 forecast, we'll look at rain amounts and more on that timing for tomorrow in just a bit. All right.